What's going on everybody? SJ back with another video for the day. Uh, the other day I bought Sakaro Shadows Die Twice. Uh, I've always been a big fan of the Dark Souls series. I'm absolutely atrocious at them, but uh, but the challenge of, of trying to beat every every person that you come up across uh, really makes the, gun, the game somewhat enjoyable to some degree. Um, it, it is frustrating and, and I'm an absolutely terrible at video games really, but uh, it, it's it's nice. I actually may be able to say I like this better than the Dark Souls series. That is pushing it though because that's a really great game series as well. Two of my favorite things about this game is number one, the combat system. Uh, the way everything is focused around posture uh, really kind of adds something new to a lot of a lot of the fighting styles. Mostly everything is just straight to the HP. When the way HP is gone, they're dead. This took a really nice little turn, kind of mixed things up a lot. The second thing I really like about this game was the, the prosthetic arm. I really enjoyed the idea of being able to kind of add the attachments to it in which you will receive throughout the game. I haven't gotten very far yet, but I have uh, saw everything that you can receive and definitely is going to be cool to, to, to play around with. Um, when I was when I was started to draw this earlier, I uh, I was thinking I was like it'd be cool to add an attachment that's not in the game. I got to thinking about one of my my other favorite games probably ever, and that's going to be the uh, the Assassin's Creed series. I was thinking about his uh, his hidden blade. I was like that might look pretty cool on on uh, Sekiro's prosthetic arm. So I I kind of did my own rendition of of the prosthetic and added the uh, the hidden blade. It's just a simple blade that would pull out uh, it's bolted with two bolts onto the the forearm there the bone it is itself I should say but this drawing was done with a 0 0.7 mechanical pencil as a pintail I used uh, just basic shading with a blending stick and then go, kept going back over areas with darker and darker and then I'd shade back over for the uh, fine erasing I was using the Tombow eraser it's a, I just got it in and it's it's really really great there's one part where I used a jelly roll to uh, add some highlighted white areas where the the light would be hitting it um, unfortunately the cameras it was off when I um, was working on that portion so it, it is not going to be in the video I do apologize about that but uh, I guess that'll just uh, make me pay attention more in the future but uh, here you go hope you all enjoy
right, as the video is coming to an end, I want to thank you all for watching. Uh, if you haven't played Sekiro Shadows Die Twice yet, I suggest y'all get it and play it. It's a great, great game. I just hope you all are better at it than I am. Um, if you like what you saw, maybe consider liking and subscribing for more content to come in the future. Until then, I hope you all have a great day.